Hey gang, what's up? Dave here in Smyrna, Georgia at Glock headquarters, or as a lot of Glock fans call it, the mothership. And what we've got here is something you all have been asking for for a long time, the long-awaited single-stat 9mm Glock Model 43. Magazine is six rounds, one more in the launch tube. Essentially, it's less of a slimmed-down Glock 26 than it is the Glock 42 to 380 on a very slight dose of steroids. Full power, 9mm power bellum. Yes, it will take and it's rated 4 plus P. Recoil is not bad at all. Uh, in typical Glock fashion, it's a very controllable pistol. And all of us who shot it today thought we'd be comfortable taking a long, hundreds of rounds shooting for us for this little gun. It's going to come with one of these short magazines that's designed for maximum concealment. One more with a little thicker flange that a lot of people find more comfortable for a pure shooting and a little easier to manipulate if they need to do a reload. It's a very slim pistol, barely an inch in, in width. Makes it a lot more comfortable for inside the waistband carry, belly band carry, attached to the vest, or ankle holster carry. One thing I particularly like with it is the trigger reach. For a whole lot of us, the regular Glock, which was designed for average adult male hand to hold at the pad on the, on the trigger, compared to on the other end of the bell curve, the little baby 380 Glock, which had such a short trigger reach that some of us had to cock our fingers upward to, to get a good, comfortable trigger position. This is kind of like Mama Bear's porridge. It's just right. For an average adult male hand like mine, the barrel in line with the forearm, the joint of the, dis the distal joint of the trigger finger comes right to the center of the trigger, giving you lots of leverage for a street safe trigger pull that's designed for a constant carry in the pocket or similar concealment locations. For people with very short fingers, maybe fingers only this long, it's still going to be no problem at all to get in there and work it from the pad. We shot hundreds of rounds today with more than half a dozen people shooting, petite females to hefty male mammals. I saw no gun-related malfunctions, one bad cartridge that we can't blame on the gun, and one accidental magazine release that was probably human error. The 380 Glock, in a single year, sold 200,000 copies. This one, slightly bigger brother, a 9mm, I think is going to set sales records.